Dear students, I welcome you in the course of Leadership, Emotional Intelligence and Decision Making. This is module number 112 and we are going to talk about the context of emotional intelligence. And the topic under discussion is that we have to be realistic. Because when we are trying to be realistic, we are trying to make the things in their real concern. We are trying to create the relationships and the associations with our followers in the rightful manner. And when we are talking about realistic, obviously realism is going to take us out of, out of from idealism. Idealism is good to develop our, our imagination, but realism is something which is more practical. So, when we talk about emotional intelligence, remember one thing, that emotional intelligence is actually having a mix of your personality traits, for example, your self-awareness, self-esteem, optimism and tolerance. And all of these things combined together are going to promote and support the context of having emotional intelligence and obviously we need to nurture it because it is a part of our nature and we need to develop it further. Second important thing that we need to understand related to emotional intelligence that different, there are different traits associated with one person and all of those traits are going to be combined in a rightful manner to support and promote our emotional intelligence and many a times traits are difficult to evaluate the relationship of success. So, with the passage of time, out of research, we are able to find out the close relationship of emotional intelligence with the success rather than leadership traits which are associated with success. The third important thing we need to understand is basically that too much self-awareness can sometimes reduce our self-esteem. The reason being that in self-awareness context, it is not just the positivities of the life that you are aware of. It is, there, are, there are also going to be negativities. Hum baaz okaat apne un aspects ko bhi janna shuru kar dete hain, jo ke hamare liye self-esteem ki reduction ka sabab wo banenge. So we need to have self-control as well. Ke agar hume kisi aisi baat ka idraak ho, jo ke hamare personality ke ya hamare zaat ke bar khilaaf hai, to hum usko control bhi kar sakein, us emotion ko control kar sakein in a way that our self-esteem should not be compromised. Another important thing is that emotional intelligence is the ability to accurately perceive and manage others' emotions as well. Because we are all humans and when we are talking about human interaction, to dusron ke bhi jo emotions hain, unka khyal rakhna hamare liye zaruri hai. What they are thinking, what they are doing, what they are perceiving, why they are thinking and perceiving that way, why they are feeling that way, in tamam cheezon ko hum tabhi samaj paayenge agar hum apni emotional intelligence ko brew a car line or usko develop karein. Now, when we talk about emotional intelligence, there are certain benefits that we need to look at. First of all, remember that emotional intelligence can help you deal with the customers in a rightful manner. Hum customer ki complaints ko, uske jazbaat ko behter tor samaj sakte hain. Secondly, remember that emotional intelligence can help mediate the disputes. Agar kahi par ikhtilaf rai ho raha hai, kahi par conflict a raha hai, कहीं पर डिस्प्यूट आ रहा है तो हम उसको टैकल कर सकते हैं व्हेन वी आर हैविंग राइट इमोशनल इंटेलिजेंस द थर्ड बेनिफिट इज दैट इमोशनल इंटेलिजेंस इज गोइंग टू क्रिएट अ स्ट्रांग पल्स इन यू अ पॉजिटिव एक्सप्रेशन इन यू जिससे कि आप स्टेक होल्डर के साथ अपने कनेक्शन को अपने रिलेशनशिप को वो स्ट्रेंथन कर सकते हो एंड अनदर इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग इज कि इमोशनल इंटेलिजेंस इज गोइंग टू इंक्रीज योर सेंस ऑफ रियलिज्म और उस रियलिज्म से हम चीजों को ज्यादा रियलिटी बेस्ड अंडरस्टैंड कर सकेंगे परसीव कर सकेंगे कंसीव कर सकेंगे ताकि हम सिचुएशन को उसकी असल सूरत हाल के अंदर जानकर उसके अंदर पाए जाने वाले प्रॉब्लम्स को हल करने के लिए अपना आइडिया अपनी क्रिएटिविटी अपना इनोवेशन परस्पेक्टिव वो पेश कर सकें डियर स्टूडेंट्स अगर हम इस सारी बात को कंक्लूड करें तो याद रखिएगा कि इमोशनल इंटेलिजेंस is the foremost important thing which a leader should have because a skill ke hone se tamam stakeholders ke saath hamara taluk hamara rabta wo behtar taur ustawar ho sakta hai 